shit. So my back, so my back is finally starting to feel better. Like this is the best it's felt in, since Saturday. It's now Wednesday. And feeling good. Cooking some turkey in the kitchen. Some of it falls on the floor. Sammy goes after it. Then Adonis has to get in because Adonis can't let Sammy have anything. And they start fighting in the kitchen. And at some point in me trying to break them up, sending Adonis to his cage, slamming the cage door, I went back and I started cooking and then I just felt my finger. Like, you know how like you don't feel something right away? I don't know what the hell I did to my finger, but do you guys see that? It is like swollen. I have it on ice right now, like it's bruised. I don't even know, I had a spatula in my hand. No one bit me. Uh, I slammed the cage door. I have no idea what I just did to my finger at all. Like, where's the video replay so I can figure out what's what I did? And the worst part is that the turkey had curry on it. <laughs> now Sammy's sneezing. But, like, what the hell? It doesn't feel like anything's broken. It just feels like swollen up. Sammy, okay? <laughs> Day in the life of Alicia wouldn't be a normal prep if I wasn't going through pain, emotional stress, and hurting myself randomly. My finger. Remember when I cut my finger before Arnold's? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Welcome to Alicia's Entertainment Circus. Okay, so I had these big dreams that, if you guys know, like most of my preps, I used to usually get up like super early. I'm talking like four in the morning and I'm like out the door and at the gym and getting things done so I get more done out of my day. Three o'clock hits. My back. Okay, so yesterday I trained legs. My back, I was telling you guys, feels the best. Felt the best that it had in a really long time. I was standing up straight. I did legs. It was great. No problems. Middle of the night. This has happened before. I don't know if I've ever talked about it on my channel. And my back seizes while I'm sleeping. And I'm not talking like uh, it feels pulled. I'm talking like I'm borderline going to call 911 because I can't get up. I can't roll. Normally, like when my back's sore, I can like roll and then like kind of like get up. But like this is like seizing to a whole nother level. You know when you get like a debilitating hamstring cramp? That's what happens in my lower back. Debilitating. Where I'm seeing stars. I'm sweating. I can't get up. I'm literally stuck wherever the hell it happens in whatever position that it happens. And it's like to move is like a 30 out of 10 pain. So I have to force myself to go through that pain to even just like roll over. So there's been times where it's happened to me and I've been on the toilet and naked and had to fall to the floor and like scream. And like, I live by myself now. So I'm like, oh my God, like how is an ambulance going to get in here? Because I'm crippled. But it, it does subside. I hobbled downstairs. I took my muscle relaxants. I took, um, the anti-inflammatories that I have from the doctor because yes, this, this happens to me before. It happens to me once every prep-ish and then I don't, I forget about it. Like I forgot it got this bad, but now I remember it does get this bad. So that happened and I thought I was going to die. I was like sweating, seeing stars, questioning my ability to function properly. And so that happened. It went away, like I came downstairs, took those, and then I found a position to lay in with a pillow, like supporting on my stomach, like supporting my midsection. It went away. So like, I'm still sideways, like standing, cause it's like still feels cramped, but like you can see. Sorry, as usual, I ran out of space. This forward pelvic tilt, so I'm not like 100% straight and like, there's like zero curve in my back. So, there's that. <laughs> um, <laughs> this current app situation. Um, details slowly coming back. It's a process. It's fine. But, yeah. So, needless to say, I didn't get my ass up super early and go do any of the things that I wanted to do. I did an update this morning. I've been slacking. It's 9 o'clock. These guys haven't even gone for a walk. So, I need to get my ass in gear, go do cardio, and get 
on with my freaking day. It's almost like every time I plan this big working day and like I'm all excited to get things done and whatever, something happens. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. Everything's in my control. I'm now able to stand and walk. I'm not sweating and seeing stars. I will not complain. Happy to be here. Happy to be helping people. Happy to have my dogs. This is what Sam is doing right now. He's like, Mom, what are you talking about? And who are you talking to? Anyway, okay. Shall we go for a walk? Donnie? I'm weird. Am I? No. You know what? I'm not weird. I do what other people do. I just record it. Not the weirdest person on the planet. Sammy, we're not weird, are we? Pa. Oh, pa. Here, pa. 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 Oh. Pa. Pa. Okay. Peace. Update. I went and did cardio this morning. Um, I did hit intervals on stairs. So I did a medium speed at 6 and then a sprint at 20-21. I can go faster, but I just want to take it kind of easy on my back. Um, it, I then, I then, I then, I then did foam rolling on my back, and it feels better. Like I can stand up straighter. I'll show you guys, but it feels tired from like the cramping, so it's like tired back. Um, I'm gonna go lift some shoulders now. I'm not gonna take you guys with me just because I will. I promise I'll start taking you guys with me to work. As for free now, I need like my time <clears throat> so there's that um, I'm gonna show you how it it's better it's weird how like the cramp in the back goes away so this I'm still kind of leaning to the side but like you see it's not bulging anymore and like I definitely have a little bit of lordosis back but it's tired I just hope tonight I don't get that weird cramping feeling again because that feeling is a death. Like sweat, stars, call 911, death. Mm. Man, I was just on this like amazing editing roll and it's been a while since new iMovie has done this to me but I can't import my clips and there's like a weird gray bar on them when I go to like select them. So annoying. So I'm trying to record something right now to see if it like resets it if I record this or something. I don't know. Anyways, Adonis, get down off my table.